pretty steep and precarious up there. Um, and we're down below us there. A little haze from the fire just south of here and north of Durango. In fact, uh, Highway 550 is closed. It's the 416 fire. So I'm going to try to take my time today. Get up in the high country, get above the trees. Still got a ways to go. Just started. 23 minutes in. So 3,000 feet of climbing, 5.6 miles. This is what I came for. Or too much snow either. It's good. Turns ahead, continue that way. At some point, I'm supposed to hit another trail, head off to the left. Supposedly, it's a third of a mile ago, so we will see. Alright, heading up Engineer Pass. Looking back down. Pass off on the right there. You see the old mining roads going up the top of that mountain. So came up that valley. Beautiful area. The part I don't like. There were a couple of jeeps out here earlier. And there probably will be, so I'm gonna hike down the road here for about a mile. Horse Thief Trail, continue on there. Some nice snow banks here. Some dirt and dust. Uh, they get all wind too, it's starting to get chilly. So, somewhere down here, some road and off to the left, the Horse Thief Trail. It's my time at elevation here, 10 thousand feet for the next two days. Yeah, a little weather. A little hail. It's kind of neat. Well, it's starting to get a little bit chilly out. Put some gloves on. That beautiful tundra, tundra up here following the uh, horse thief trail. Um, a couple more miles. And, uh, hopefully, American night will break. Put some warm clothes on. It's on brief to come out. Got a little snow. Gorgeous now. My hands are freezing now. Ay, ay, ay. Feet a little wet too. Look, like snow.
I'm really glad I brought my tent. i sleep in that tonight. I'm going to hike in 4 hours and 6 minutes, 9.54 miles, 1,358 feet of ascent. Hmm. Hat on, rain clad jacket, long sleeve shirt. Still in shorts though. Peaks on all sides, so hopefully I won't get hit by any lightning. Uh, wish I brought my book. But I do have my uh, some music and podcast. Uh, and now just looking at the map, trying to watch it. It's hailing now. Hard to see, but the sun came out, started cooking the tent. It's got about 70 degrees in there. You can see the clouds and storm that just went by, but uh, it's pretty gorgeous out now. I'm down in a little creek there and uh, wash my feet. They're looking a little dirty. But, yeah, beautiful. I saw some elk down below in the valley uh, before the storm. Difficult Trail, and I uh, know why it's called Difficult Trail, it's uh, not a very well defined trail, probably for your rock cairns, posts, the post up there, um, a cold night, or a cold morning, below freezing this morning when I woke up, but I was camping about 11,700 feet, I had all my clothes on, packed up camp, and uh, I could fly an hour and a half. So, so far so good, legs still little tired, but not sore. I hiked down that valley earlier today, come along the ridge line, cut back along the creek that comes down here, and up uh, the trail. Nice morning, 60 degrees. Came up this 
steep hill here. Just saw him over there. And we timed it up here. Pretty cool. The trail starts heading down. Off to the left down there, the red. It's uh, already. Not sure how far it will go loop on my mountain bike and then uh, ride seven to those miles back. See the lake down there. Nice view. Everywhere, not cut, not maintained. Now the trail just ends. Let's see where this one goes. Six miles are all downhill. Oh, my legs are a little tired. I mentioned I'm getting a little sore. Alright, here we are. Last trail. On the Cutler Creek Trailhead. It's like down that way, about a mile. Uh, and this hike is over except for the bike ride uh, up to the start. Up a ways to where I started, Bear Creek. Yeah. There's downtown, hurry. Right. Gotta go climb that hill at the end of right up on the bluff. Right. Climbing for 5.8 miles. Oh, I don't know whose idea this was. Mine, obviously. Thought this would be fun. Got a pack, a 20 pound pack, 3 pounds of weights on me. That'll be the bike box. Now, keep on going. my hours speed on it. What do you think? 4.2. Hurt my butt off. 